Namaste beautiful you in this video I'm going to share with you four tips to enjoy your meditation practice I've been meditating for about eight years now and some things just really enhance your meditation practice making it more joyful so I'll share those tips with you a very first important tip is to be kind to yourself during meditation so Practice to not feel irritated when your mind wanders, when you're trying to focus it, if you're doing a focus meditation. Also, you know, if you don't, in whatever way, if you have goals in your mind with meditation and you don't reach them, be kind to yourself. Practice compassion. That's a very important tip. Don't have a rigorous practice. You do not have to meditate every day for an hour. You do not even have to meditate every day. You don't have to have a regular meditation practice. Meditation is, if you want it to be joyful and enjoyable, then let the enjoyment be the factor that makes you sit in meditation posture again. I have never, oh yes, I have one time tried to do a, a certain mindfulness program. And that's actually where I did not succeed to meditate every day. I did for three or four weeks and then I just, oh, you know. But um, in the rest of those years of meditation, I just, I feel naturally drawn to meditate at least once a week, but usually daily. And it's, it's the joy that makes me go to the meditation cushion. If you want to have joy, let joy be your guide in when to meditate or when not to meditate. Let it be natural. Three, very important, be comfortable. If your body is uncomfortable during meditation time, um, sure there are meditation traditions in which they say just keep seated just keep seated have a straight back <laughs> but if your back is really hurting um my <laughs> modest opinion is that um it's better not to have a hurting back during meditation there are things you can do to make your meditations more comfortable and if you're more comfortable you'll be more able to enjoy your meditation practice and to focus better on what you're doing and ways to make your body more comfortable during meditation are yoga, for example, uh, or a different kind of exercise routine, but I would really advise yoga, you know, asana yoga. So it can be, for example, hatha yoga or vinyasa yoga, whatever you like. And that will make your, that, I mean, the whole purpose of asana yoga, asana meaning posture, um, the whole purpose of it is to prepare the body for meditation. And it's a meditation in and of itself, of course. So yeah, make your body comfortable. You can also, of course, adjust the way you're seated. You don't have to have a straight back and cross-legged position. You can also, the first years I meditated, I usually sat on my couch. And um, sometimes I would sit upright and sometimes I would lean. Um, you can place some pillows in your lower back that helps you to feel upright while you do have some support. And you can also do it lying down, at least if you don't fall asleep. You can also do it standing. And there are also, for example, walking meditations. And actually, basically, you can make everything into a meditation, of course, if you're practicing mindful movement. All right, the fourth tip is to try out different meditation practices. You don't have to do only Vipassana or only mindfulness or only new age meditations. You can do, you know, whatever meditation you would like to try out. So some ideas, for example, are also tantric meditation or transcendental meditation. Um, you can look into Buddhist meditations. 
Um, I would say there are also Christian meditations, maybe they're called prayer. <laughs> um, Sufi meditations. So, and also just many, many more, you know. So have a look at all the kinds of meditations there are and find what works for you. Because you really don't have to do a Zen meditation if you are not enjoying it. Find what you enjoy. There are many, many, many paths to spiritual growth. So choose the one that suits you. Even if there's some master person saying to you that this is the best way, or um, you have to do, you have to choose one road, don't take it, you know, find what works for you. All right, these were my tips. I hope it will help you. Um, you can ask me questions in the comments below or let me know how you like the video. Also, if you have any questions for me, if you want me to make a certain video on a certain topic, let me know in the comments and I would love to hear. That's it. <laughs>